Okay, everyone, I thought I'd do a uh, first opening of my uh, Bell Patriot helmet. Ordered online from um, Amazon since nobody locally had one in a size large. I guess there's a big run on them, maybe because of the 4th of July or something, who knows what, so I had to order it from Amazon. Uh, I opened the box, just the outer box, because I want to make sure this was the helmet, because I've ordered a couple other things, and I want to make sure it wasn't uh, open something else up. So, here we go. One. So this is the bell box there. Make sure everybody can see that. Let me move this up just a skosh. There we go. Using my smartphone and a tripod here, so bear with me, make sure it works. So here we go. Inside, owner's manual. Nothing major there. Wow, nice bell cover. That looks real nice. So here we are. Wow. Very nice. Everybody see that? Make sure. Yeah, there we go. Bell Patriot. This is the Bell Vortex. Snell M2010 approved along with DOT. I always like the better uh, Snell rating. Even though I'm not going to go to the track, it is track rated, but um, I just like it for additional security and uh, for, your, for your noggin. It's got a nice interior case or interior padding. Can't really see too well. Get a little bit of video of it. Has the really easy to adjust. Push a little button there. Push a little button here. Off comes the face shield. So super easy to change out shields in the field. That was it. That's how easy it was. Matter of fact, I do have a, a, a dark tint that I bought. Let's put that on. Take this off. Set the helmet right there. Everybody see that? Yeah. There's the bell dark tint. So again, we just position it and it will click into place once I put it in the right slot. Oh, there you go. My mistake. Trying to put it in the wrong hole. I guess us guys know about that, right? So there is. Oh, yeah, it looks sweet with the dark tint. Look at that. And I can change this out so fast. So if it gets dusk, nighttime, a quick pull over, open, and flip it out. Put the new one on. There it is. Ready for nighttime. Cling wrap off of it. There we are. So one bell vortex. I love these little back vents here. Side vents. We have upper vents here and here. And we have a front vent here and upper one right here. So very well ventilated. It's got a place I'll be hooking up my Cena SMH10 to it. 
I'm going to use this as my primary helmet now, I think, because I do have I do have this fly racing that I bought, ADV, you know, dual purpose helmet. And it's nice, but this front, I get a lot of wind buffeting. You can't really change the shield out without taking all this apart. So I think, uh, other than that, it's a great helmet. I mean, nothing wrong with it. Fits really well. I'm going to take my Cena off here, and I'll put it on the bell. Because I do mostly street riding with some off-road. And I got this, you know, because my bike is dual Buell Yuli. But I think overall, without the wind buffeting, especially at high speeds, that I'll use the, um, the bell. There's a side-by-side, -side, as you can see. The bell, the um, fly is a uh, matte. The bell is a gloss. So overall, I, you know, actually I haven't tried it on. Hold on a second here. Let's try it on. Oh yeah, fits great. All right. Well, I tried one on a different one at uh, a local store, but they didn't have a Patriot. I would have got a loaf from a local store, but... No Patriot, and I really want the Patriot to go with my American theme with an American-made motorcycle, the Buell, or mostly American. I don't think anything nowadays is 100% American. But it's as much as a American sport bike can be. So there's the look of it. I like the little stars right here on top by the vents. It's a profile of it. Love these little back vortex, pull air out, I guess. I don't know, I haven't driven it yet. But I'm definitely going to have the, uh, the dark tint on. Excuse me, I'm doing this. Got to figure it out exactly here. There we go. Perfect. So the look of it with the dark shield just looks awesome. I mean, look at that. It's really well padded. I love the neck skirt. It's got a front chin skirt here. Can't really see inside, but it is padded really well. Well, of course, to be Snell 2010, I guess, along with DOT. So, looking forward to uh, first ride on the Bell Vortrex Patriot.